With warmer weather, tourists begin to flock to Oxford in part to enjoy its many restaurants. People like Water Valley native Rayford Edgar and his wife helped drive that local industry. Edgar says it's all about location. They have some special uh, type food that we do not have there. And, uh, and of course, we like the atmosphere. And we've had all our children and grandchildren going to school at Ole Miss. And that has a lot to do with, I, I went to school at Ole Miss and all of my family. And that has a lot, of, a lot to do with it. That special type of food has allowed local restaurants such as McAllister's to grow beyond Oxford. Whether you like your soup in a bread bowl or with a spud, McAllister's Deli has you covered. Oxford is a town that's known for its southern cuisine, but recently they've started adding a little flavor from south of the border. South Depot Taco Shop has enjoyed success over the last two years using assembly line production to bring your food to you just the way you want it. Le Paz is the most recent addition to the square, and they hope to enjoy the same success in a fresher way. Uh, you know, pretty, pretty much everybody's going to sell the same things. It's, it's the way you do it. You know, and, uh, we, we have a very good prep staff that you know, has been working very hard. They come in every day and they do eight hours of prep work because we do everything fresh here. Along with drink specials almost daily, Le Paz hopes that its Tex-Mex cuisine can join the long line of successful restaurants in Oxford. From Oxford, Stephen Quinn, WCBI.